Hello, so this is Alana from Shipper HQ, and I'm excited to show you how to offer a simple local delivery in minutes using Shipper HQ. So I'm going to walk you through setting up a flat rate local delivery option that's restricted by a distance radius from a single store location. This is a quick and easy way to offer local delivery if you're planning on running the deliveries yourself or you have a career that you're working with that doesn't provide live rates. Um, either way, this should work for you. It's a is a good simple solution. So this example that we're gonna show you how to set up is done on the Shopify platform, although the outcome and the results will be the same with, whether you were using like BigCommerce or WooCommerce or Magento, um, any of those are going to look the same and act the same for what we're about to do here today. So the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna head over to the Shopify app store and we're gonna uh, install Shipper HQ in our Shopify store and shipper hq comes with a 30-day free trial which is the same regardless of which platform you're installing this for um, once we install that we'll be able to see shipper hq in our installed apps here in our shopify store and one of the things it's going to do during the installation is push us over to the shipper hq dashboard where we will be able to set up and manage our shipper hq account and the first thing that it's going to have us do is set up a shipping origin so a shipping origin is any location that you are distributing your products from and that you are shipping from particularly in this example we are going to use um, an austin texas warehouse location so we're going to go ahead and enter the address of our austin texas warehouse location in there and hit save uh, and the next thing we're going to do is head over to the carriers section and we're going to add a carrier uh, and in Shipper HQ, any carrier that is not getting live rates um, from a service like UPS or FedEx is considered a custom carrier. So we are going to select a flat rate custom carrier. And then we are going to name our carrier local delivery. And this is what our customers are going to see at the checkout as far as the carrier is concerned. So we're going to continue. It looks like we've added that successfully to our list of carriers in Shipper HQ. And the next thing we're going to do is configure our carrier so that we can set that delivery radius. So we'll see that our carrier title was brought in here and it's also been automatically attached to our default origin, which is our Texas warehouse. Um, and we can see that we can change the method name here. So we can change the method name. Um, I'm going to call it courier. And then we can set our flat rate shipping here. So I'm gonna say that it's $10 to do our local pre -del flat delivery. And then you can also apply that per item or for the entire order, but for the purposes of this demo, we're gonna do it for the entire order. Um, the next thing we're gonna do is hop over here to our optional section. And here's where we can restrict it by zone. So we can go ahead and create zones if we'd like, and we can create zones by, um, anything as granular as a zip code or a postal code or a range of zip and postal codes, but we are going to instead choose to restrict by a specified radius. So we're gonna pick a distance here and the distance we're gonna pick is 20 miles. Um, and we're gonna save that carrier. And you'll see that we have a local delivery flat rate carrier in our Shipper HQ now, and we're going to go ahead and enable that. And as soon as we enable that, that will become available on our checkout on the front end for our customers because we have already installed Shipper HQ in Shopify. Anything that we do here in Shipper HQ is going to be live as soon as we enable it. So let's go over to our Shopify store and we will add something to our cart. Um, and let's go ahead and check out. And the address we're going to use in checkout is going to be an address that's obviously within the 20 mile radius. And here we'll see our local delivery courier, $10. And of course, if we were to do this per item, uh, the $10 would duplicate for the number of items in the cart. Anyways, um, there you have it. Thanks for checking out our demo. And if you have any questions about this or anything else Shipper HQ can do, don't hesitate to reach out to us at shipperhq.com with any questions that you have. We're happy to help you get started doing local delivery any way that we can. Great, thanks.